right, folks. Hey, welcome. You're listening to Racer Radio right here on FM 96.1 AM 1170. I'm Dave. And I'm Michelle. And we're the answer. This segment is brought to you by Verona Circle Track. Let me tell you, El Cajon Ford really supports this segment, and they support Verona Speedway not only uh, with radio and television and, and, you know, just help it out all the way around, plus the whole family races out there. Yeah, All right. Hey, it. guess what? I got my old buddy in the house. I have not seen this guy, Nick Novak. I haven't seen him for a while. I've seen him off and on for years. He's grown up since the last time I seen him. He's got himself his little trucking company, but he's decided to go racing. He used to be drag racing. At a what year was your Chevy truck? Uh, at an 80 Chevy truck. And I used to call it the Hay Hauler. Yep. Because he would kick people's butt with that truck. Yeah, it went a lot. You won too much. You had people angry at you that you won so many. <laughs> yeah, races. you're one of those guys. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Bucket. <laughs> so, what got you from going straight to now making hard lefts at Barona Speedway? I had kids. My wife and I had kids, and racing slowed down. Business, bought house, sold house, all kinds of stuff. And things just kind of like just started calming down. Uh-huh. And I was up at, uh, up at Barona on opening night with a friend of mine. We were sitting there. I'm like, man, why are we not doing this? You know, we should be doing this. Yeah. And uh, he's like, I'm in. Let's do it. So I had a 59 Cadillac that I'd had for a couple of years. I sold that two days later. And I think it was two days after that, I found a car on Facebook for a thousand bucks, bought it, got it home. What'd you get? What'd you buy? It's a 77 Nova, two door, okay. small block in it. Oh, three perfect. Speed. That's great. <laughs> yeah. And uh, didn't know what to expect. Never done it. I had caught, talked to my buddy, Ryan. Uh, he's one of my sponsors. Uh-huh. He uh, talked to him every day, multiple times a day, trying to learn what the heck I was doing with the thing and <laughs> <laughs> put it together in three weeks. Now, what division are you in? This is a uh, pure stock up at Barona. Okay. Pure so stock. there you can't really do anything to it. Not much. I mean, it's got a cage in it. You got to have safety gears yeah, and got, a fuel cell and stock, all that. Yeah. It's stock stuff. You can cut some stuff out. And but no engine, no suspension, no. no tires and wheels. No, no, but yeah, you can put wheels on it. And the, there's good tires you can buy that are DOT legal tires. Gotcha. Um, and then uh, I did a burnout in my driveway the day that we got it. It started right up. The car did. <laughs> did a burnout in my driveway. Broke the rear end. <laughs> so I had to rebuild the rear end right away. Get it running. We went out and tested it. Shook it down and it was perfect. I was like, man, the heck are we doing here? You know. So the next weekend, it, was, it ended up being three weeks. We went out and raced. The, you know, and I I started in the back, learned how to do it. Went to the heat race, ended up getting second in the heat race. I'm like, <laughs> what? What? What's going on I, here? This is I come just too the, easy. <laughs> I haven't even read the instruction <laughs> book. I come off the track. And my dad's like, "You got second. I'm like, "Hey, he's like, you, there's only two cars that finished." I'm like, "Ah, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> everybody else crashed or got black flagged." Or whatever. But you got second. But you I got second. It. So you I went to the trophy dash uh-huh. and uh, was that four laps of the trophy dash. Yeah. It's with the three other fat, the three fastest guys there. Yeah. And I said, I'm not passing anybody. I'm just going to, as Cruise. fast as these guys are going, I'm going to stick with them. And they were driving like 80 feet deeper into the corner that I was. And I just learned a lot in like four laps. Yeah. I ended up, uh, I was trying to make a pass in the main event. That was my first night. And I, I didn't do very well. <laughs> this last one though, I went in and uh, I legitimately got second place in the heat race. And then went and went into the main event. And I led like half the main event, like by a bunch too. I don't know. I don't know. Well, I, I, I have no idea what I'm doing. I'll, well, be, I'll be honest with you. Well, I know Brittany. She said that you, when you were chatting with her, that you were a rookie. Yeah. And she says, "There's no way that kid could be a rookie." I'm a rookie. She I have, said, "There's no it's way." It's just dumb luck. It really is. Well, you're having fun, and you're not I'm taking it a blast. You're not taking it super, super serious. Yeah. No, we're having too we're, much fun. It's so much fun. Yeah. It's so much fun. Like, and there's times during the race where I'm looking around like. How did I do this? <laughs> I mean, three weeks ago, I was in the stands drinking beers with my buddy. Right. <laughs> and now I, here, I have $2,500 in my whole program. I'm not talking the car. I'm talking uh, the whole The whole, the whole setup. And, and that in, these that guys. includes an easy up. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. I've right. That's your, that's your race day setup. Did, yeah. It's, did uh, you get how many on your crew? Uh, me, Doug Raiders, John Kelly. Uh, my dad's there. My dad hates hated the idea. So I told him thank you because he just fueled my hate fire for the whole yep. thing. Well, of course. Yep. So I just like, hey, you sit over there then. So I made him cook hot dogs a couple weeks ago. Is he <laughs> loving it now? He loves it. Yeah, oh, he God. loves it. Yeah, his buddy he came out. Uh, his buddy came out a couple weeks ago, and yeah, it's been 
it's been awesome. The well, and it takes a lot of pressure off your daily job because I know working yeah. what, six days a week yeah. sometimes. Yeah, it's it's, uh, it's a stress reducer. Yeah, and it gives all of us something to do on the weekends, and it's cheap, good and you're fun. hanging out with your buddies. Hanging out. The track's awesome. I got my wife helping me. My kids are scraping mud. That's it. I mean, right. how old are your kids? Uh, my son, Jacob, he's nine. My daughter, Lucy, she's seven. Oh Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. And they're, they're wild. They're wild. Well, I'll take after their dad. Yeah. Yeah. More well, wild than I ever was. They're yeah, right. They're yeah, good, good, good. right. No, uh, let me, good, good. Can I call your dad right now real quick like, yeah. and do a confirmation <laughs> yeah, on that he'll comment? Tell he'll tell you. My daughter, she's something else. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So you're running the whole season. I am going to run the whole season, yep. And, and uh, you're a rookie this year. You, you think you might get rookie of the year? I don't know. I don't even know if that. What that means. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. How do you get that? I don't know. Because they on. have a different rookie of the year for each class. Yeah. So yeah. like they have one like for the six year olds and stuff, you know. But uh, I can beat them. You can no, beat them, maybe. Own, yeah. Um, so no, you might you might want to look into it. Well, don't even worry about it. Just have fun, and if you get it, it's yeah. just a bonus. Well, yeah. Then you'll have to come back and talk to so us. So who again. you got on the side of the car? Uh, Elite Trucking. My buddy Ryan. He's the one who helped me get into this deal. He's I blame him for all of it. Good. Uh, Express Pipe and Supply. They just came on this week. I put it thanks out. to a video you video did. I did on Facebook. Uh, Mark Rose, he gave me a bunch of rad tools. He's just a good dude. He's a good dude to have around too. Sure. He helps me out out out, out the racetrack. It's really oh, cool. good. Uh, Kelly and Associates is uh, the premier trucking guy in town, in my opinion. He's a good dude. He just mm-hmm. he's off the video as well. He's like, dude, I have to do it. Let's right. do it. So he covered the beer bill for us. Uh, <laughs> Palumbo Family Family Vineyards. They're up in Temecula. It's a thirteen acre. Uh, Winery up there, vineyards, it's beautiful. And hey, he must be in trouble. Oh, boy. Troy said he took your rookie flag off of your car. Yeah. Two races in. Is that a good thing? Well, I'm supposed That's- to have it for three, and the race director sent me a message the other day. He's like, get those things off your car. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah. this is a guy that does has never done this before. Yeah. And never. Then, uh, Troy Dirt. <sighs> yeah. yeah. What, what could you say? I mean, without what Troy Dirt, say? not only for you... For but everybody. For I mean, everybody. Helps, I, I give the guy a ton of grief. Like we he's one of my best friends. We're we supposed talk to all day, we? every day. Yeah. But <laughs> yeah. he really he's done a great job up there. Him, Todd, everybody. They've done a great job with the place, making it it's just so much better. Yeah. Know? And it's 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 really. I mean, every every race it just gets better and gets better and gets better. Right. There's more fun. I mean, you were I mean, you were even gotten involved, talked to him into bringing the side by sides in. Yeah. He says that I didn't, but I did. Well, he'll, of course he'll not. never he'll never he'll say never. That. By the way, you got to take that picture on the trunk of your car yeah. and blow it up and put it on the hood. I know. I know. And then get 500 bucks from him. Yeah. He'll pay it. I'll let him drive it. You want to no, drive I wouldn't, it? I wouldn't let him drive it. You want to drive it? I might drive it. Yeah, I may. Let's come go. on, drive it. Let's go. Heck yeah. It's fun. Well, yeah. See, and you didn't even, and you didn't even know it. You never even drove anybody else's car. You just got no. in this one. No, I had no idea. I had, uh, I had uh, no idea. No idea. <laughs> I think I call that talent. No, like no, no, raw no. talent. Well, no, 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 no. no. I, I'm, she, he's going to agree with me. I, <laughs> I think no. I know he's got talent. You know, he's got. He knows how to race. He's I watched just, Cody. You never met Cody. Cody's a kid that Cody uh, his dad's a crew chief on my car, and the kid's a stud. I mean, oh, he's an absolute stud. unbelievable. And we raced. We raced Spa One Thousand, Spa Five Hundred. We did short course. We raced trucks, cars, everything, and everything the kid did, you just get blown away. Mm. So I've been watching him for like six, six, seven years now. Yeah. All the time. He sounds very talented, So too. now let me ask yeah. you about Cody. Is uh, oh. Cody maybe starting to think about Because, you know, Cody loves to race. He'll race anything with an engine. Yeah. Cody's knee-deep in school right now. Knee-deep. Uh, he hasn't been able to make a race yet because he's been really busy with school stuff and whatever else. But Doug is on the hunt for a pure stock. Oh, do you have to show that to ah, her? Ah. Well, Troy sent it to me. Of so course I he to- is. Of course so, he is. So you that's know, on the hood of Troy's is, car, right? This is what you do when you know someone's close to you like a brother and yeah. you give them a hard time. Yeah, that's not me, though. That's just my face yeah. on, right. on the yeah. All right, buddy. What's, what's the number of your car? Uh, 79. And if people want to throw some money at you or beer or pizza, because I know you're looking for a beer sponsor, got, a pizza sponsor. Yeah. You know who you should go after? Who? Antonelli's. Let's the go. Deli. Give me a phone number. I, Google it. You're a kid. Antonelli's needs to. They don't, well, because they listen. used to do. They used to do all the race cars at Collins Speedway. And I don't see anybody going yeah. over there and hitting them up. He, can, yeah. he suggests them all the time, and doesn't seem like anybody. Nobody goes uh, out. It's right there in the El Cajon, uh, yeah. Bradley. Yeah, Antonelli's going there. Tell, pitch them. 
Gosh, their I bet food. they have good meatball sandwiches. Oh, their food is off the charts. Everything's good there. Yeah, yeah, you can find me on Facebook. It's under Nick Novak or Instagram. It's at, at JN Trans. Okay. That's the best way to get a hold of me. Great. Cool. All right, buddy. Hey, we're going to definitely have you back in again. I can't this wait. has been fun. I can't yeah, wait. Thanks for coming in. All right.